security system that monitor and control the incoming and outgoing network traffic based on predetermined security rules. A firewall typically establishes a barrier between a trusted, square, secure internet, internal network and, and other external networks such as the internet. As a security analyst, a good understanding of the operations and interpretation of firewall log is important not only to investigate pass attack, attacks even, but also to help monitor suspicious activity in real time. There are two different types of firewall, the stateful and stateless firewall. Understanding the difference, differences between the two will help you analyze and inter, interpret the laws. Stateful firewalls control access on a session-by-session -session basis, taking into consideration the session rule and the transport in application layer. These sessions also take into account previous activity within session to help make access decision. To further understand how firewalls operate, you must also understand the three-way handshake of a TCP, TCP connections. When starting a TCP session, a client must send the send packet to the server and present its initial sequence number. The server will respond with the send act representing its initial sequence number as well as acknowledging the client's initial sequence number. Finally, the client will send an act back to the server to acknowledge the server's initial sequence number. As data is sent, the sequence number increment according with amount of data sent. The connection will gracefully close when the pin packet is exchanged at the end of session. So I explain um, TCP 3 handway shake in a detail in a separate video. You can check uh, the video link in description for further detail. During a network attack, the attacker might try to break the rule of the TCP 3 way handway handshake to confuse the system and cause unintended behavior. Stateful firewall recognize when rules are broken and will drop the offending packet to mitigate the attack. Any violation of the TC protocol is recognized by the stateful firewall and rejected. For example, the X scan, which is an effective attack against Packet filter is recognized by a stateful firewall because the TCP connection information doesn't match that of the firewall state table. When this happens, the firewall will drop the illegitimate ACK packet. Vice over IP and FTP are example of common protocol that use the control channel to facilitate dynamical negotiated connections on today's network. State full firewalls can provide inspection of control channel applications with FTP, a client connect to the server on TCP port board 21, which is the control channel. There are two FTP modes, active mode and passive mode. In active mode, the server responds to the client request on port 21 with a connection on port 20. In passive mode, the client requests a connection and the server responds with a port number. The client will then initiate the dynamic connection using the server provided port. Stateless packets filter have trouble dealing with FTP. In the case of stateless system, it is impossible to limit or control which applications are allowed to connect from the inside to the outside when in passive mode. The reverse is true in an active mode because you can't restrict application access from the outside to the inside when using a stateless firewall. When a stateful firewalls, you can monitor the control channel of FTP sessions. State tables are populated by the firewall as the connections are being made. The firewalls can check things such as SEN, SENAC and port number in order to know what to expect in the return path of the three-way handshake. This works for both active and passive FTP sessions. ACL used on a stateless packet filter are preferred packet by packet but ACL use on a stateful firewall are only refer, reference, referenced session by session. 
If a send packet is received at a stateful firewall, the stateful firewall check the ACL configuration to determine if it should allow the connection. If it is permitted, an entry is made in the state table. The state table now controls the bidirectional flow of all the packets that are associated with this connection.